men wanted in murder of rapper Young Dolph captured in Indiana, U.S. Marshal Sire first-degree murder warrant was issued for Justin Johnson, 23, last week. A Tennessee man wanted in connection with the fatal shooting of rapper Young Dolph, who was gunned down in a daylight ambush at a popular cookie shop in November in his hometown of Memphis, has been captured in Indiana, U.S. Marshals announced Tuesday afternoon. A first-degree murder warrant was issued last week for Justin Johnson. 23, in the November 17 shooting of young Dolph, whose real name is Adolph Thornton Jr. Johnson. More details are expected to be released at a press conference Wednesday with U.S. Marshal Tyrese Miller, Memphis Police Chief C.J. Davis, and Shelby County District Attorney General Amy Weirich. The Marshal's Service and the Memphis Police Department have been searching for suspects in the killing. A $15,000 reward has been offered for information leading to an arrest. The shooting stunned the city of Memphis and shocked the entertainment world. Police said two men exited a white Mercedes Benz and fired shots into a Memphis bakery where young Dolph, 36, was buying cookies and killed him. Police released photos taken from surveillance video that captured the shooting, but investigators have not released any information about a possible motive. Known for his depictions of tough street life and his independent approach to the music business, young Dolph was admired for charitable works in Memphis. He organized Thanksgiving food giveaways, donated thousands of dollars to high schools, and paid rent and covered funeral costs for people in the Castalia Heights neighborhood where he was raised. City officials and community activists pointed to the killing as a symbol of the dangers of gun violence in Memphis where more than 300 homicides were reported last year. A private funeral was held for young Dolph on November 30th and a section of a street in the neighborhood where he grew up was renamed for him December 15th. He was honored a day later at a public celebration at FedEx Forum, the home of the NBA's Memphis Grizzles and the University of Memphis men's basketball team.